Politics are at the center of any game of Superpower 3. After all, you are a politician, a head of state in charge of your country. You will make decisions affecting your fellow citizens and affecting the relations of your nation with the rest of the world. The heartbeat of domestic life in your country is the same as in the real world, where regular elections are won and lost. If you do not win your election, it means that someone else has. So you better try to avoid that. Of course, postponing elections indefinitely is a possibility. But it comes with the price of damaging your standing and approval rating, as well as your international relationships. The better way is simple, to win elections. Going rogue and outlawing the opposition also comes with varying degrees of consequences. Although it might seem harder, the best way is to be liked by your population. The way to achieve that is to provide the social, political, and economic stability and prosperity they desire. A population facing poverty, inequality, or even starvation will likely not look kindly on their leader who keeps them in this situation. On the international stage, the decisions are sometimes more difficult. With whom do you want to increase your relationship in order to sell or buy resources? Who do you try to move away from? How to manage these relationships can quickly become quite a maze to navigate. Remember that many things are connected, and the one link they all share is politics. You manage the population, you make or break the economic treaties and decide where to invest, and you decide on military relationships, alliances and foes. Treaties can be a complex affair where you can combine multiple elements from bribing to threatening and everything in between other countries to achieve your political goals at home and abroad. Your political decisions in Superpower 3 will have the greatest impact on the fate of your nation.